In this video, we will look at how to morph different objects in geometry nodes. Let's morph the default cube into a sphere object. Since the basis of morphing is movement of the vertices by adding a subdivide mesh node to the default cube, adjust the number of vertices to be somewhat similar. Since morphing basically changes the position value on the points, add a set position node. Since the position information value of the subdivided cube is needed, a capture attribute node is added. Change to vector mode. Add a position node and connect it to the value socket of the capture attribute. Since the position information of the ICO sphere is also required, a transfer attribute node is added. It changes to vector, nearest mode. Connect the ICO sphere mesh socket to the source socket and the position socket to the attribute. Add a mix RBG node and connect it to the attribute socket. A basic morphing node tree has been constructed. Check the result while adjusting the subdivision value. This video ends here. Thank you for your time.